Sometimes I get so mad, there's no control in me. My thoughts get so bad, I'm like, I might grab a bat. I don't know my wrath, my blood boils over like. Oh God, here goes. I lost all feeling from my head to my toes. You said some shit that I can't let go, so just stay tuned for the rest of the show. So have you ever felt betrayed? Switch your style, you see things. Realize something needs change. Cause I know you got me up. Let me show you what's up. Cause enough is enough. I'll take a face full of payment just to make a statement. I know there's no turning back. Oh God, adrenaline wasted. So mad I can taste it. I know there's no turning back. Well, good evening, everybody. I'm Jimbo. And I'm Kemper. Happy birthday, buddy. <laughs> Thank you, brother. <laughs> oh, it's good to hear from you on your birthday. I'm glad you ain't out there partying and, and you know, not able to make it. No. Partying, no. boozer. I was going to say maybe 15 years ago, but yeah, oh, I ain't God. got the energy. <laughs> oh, Hey, everybody in chat. Welcome. Kim Louise, Paige, Mama Two, Renee, Erica, Miss Horse Whisper. I know I'm going to miss some people. Little buddy Sammy came in. Uh, hey, Aisley, cool. Trish, Nicolina, Queen Ashley. I think I said Erica already. We got a bunch. We got a bunch of crowd in here tonight, buddy. A bunch of them. Oh, yeah. I think we're going to have some more rolling in. I, you know, we got something to say tonight, Kemper. <laughs> yeah, we do. That was oh. a good email I got from you today. Baby, like, hey, woo, doggy, it's gonna be fun. Yeah. Hey, John <laughs> Cena, thank you for being a member for eight months. He said, "Happy birthday, Kemper." Thank you, John. John Cena, now you see me, now you don't. See you, Sammy. Thanks for stopping by, buddy. <laughs> thank you, Sammy. Sammy knows it's about to get adult in here. Oh, yeah. So he exits. Thank you, buddy. We appreciate him coming by. I like Sammy. He's a good kid. Usually it doesn't take long for it to get adult. No, it don't. Um, I got a little video I want to play. Of course, I put an overlay on there. And, you know, it's not so much who says who's interviewing, but what the response is. It leads us right in. To what we're going to go over tonight. Nice. Let me, let me see if this will work. Let me try it like this.
<laughs> you can't use you can't take, you can't take a you can't take a criminal. And back it up. I want, want y'all see the intro here. You can't use you can't take, you can't take a you can't take a criminal and use that as a fact. You can't use that as a fact. Those, You're those, a criminal. Those, those, I give you credit for coming. You're up a here. criminal. What do you mean? You how are a I, criminal, Ernie Shell. How am I a criminal? Really? Do you have a record? No. Yes, you do. Or really? No, I don't. I, I've got my You're record. full of shit. No, you're full of shit. You absolutely have a record. So do okay, not stand up here and tell me that you cannot take somebody's record into account when it comes to their credibility. Uh, can I can I send you my uh, file? Can I send you my background? I don't know. I already have your file. Okay, then pull everybody it. has your file. Screenshot. It's all over the fucking internet. All, all you're doing is running <clears throat> your mouth right now. Show your proof. Yeah, sure. All I'm doing is running my mouth. I just your had file my rant, is I just all had my over the fucking six days ago. Yeah, no, I just you just blame it on PTSD. Yeah. Is what you just, again, again. Yeah, no, no you're not that. guilty of anything because well, you're you have an active warrant, Ernie. Don't you? You have an active warrant. Show me, show me where I'm guilty of it. Show me where I'm, 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 I'm uh, guilty of anything. I'm yeah, no, show me where I'm convicted. Blame it on your brother. Blame it on PTSD. Blame it on whatever. Yeah. Show me, show me where I'm convicted. Give me a minute. Of anything. I got you, Ernie. I have, a, I have, I have two misdemeanors on me. That's it. Oh, Ernie. That's it. Ernie, I'd like, to, I'd like to ask you a question. Yeah, go ahead. You do know who Turtle Boy is, right? Uh, Turtle Boy? No, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. All right, well, I was trying to make a build up to a joke, but I'll just say this. I have almost <laughs> 20 felony charges on my background. And I'm about the most honest yeah. motherfucker that you'll ever meet. So don't be saying that all criminals, you know, fucking are liars because it's total bullshit. The truth is he doesn't have any convictions yet because he hasn't shown up to court. So. Yeah, no, but he has shown up to court and he's just oh. extended it. He's given okay. up excuses. We've all seen it because it's all been out on YouTube. I don't know okay. what fucking game he's trying to play. Like it's all been out there. And he like, who the fuck are you send trying to email. Call? Send me an email. email. Have a felony you. theft uh, conviction on you? Felony theft? Who me? Yeah. No. Okay. Send me send me your email. If you send me an email, I'll send you my damn uh, uh, will, report that was just pulled here six days ago. It's not hard to pull your report. Well, you have a failure to appear, failure to appear. It's Actually, I would, if it was me, I'd rather pull the report myself I would. rather than it being handed to yeah. me because rather I don't trust anyone shit. word for it. Well, I mean, I tend to go, and, uh, it's just verified. like any good reporter. It's just like any good reporter. You go and investigate it yourself. Uh, yourself. I'll tell, I'll tell, I'll tell we you don't get it from would, you. Ernie. Can I send you my We'll get it ourselves. You get arrested for felony theft, but you haven't shown up yet. Ernie, uh, if you look in the back, actually, uh, I do have an email here I'm going to provide you. Uh, I would be happy to actually have you send that over so I can cross-reference it. With can, I also send, can I also send my certifications, my weapons training, and yeah, all that? I, 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 well? do, do, yeah, you can send, send it all. whatever you'd like. Yeah, no, absolutely. Nobody I, I gives think, a fuck get, about it. Uh, I do, <laughs> actually. I think this is... I don't know. Yeah, because you said I've never done anything. Um, but, but I think my point is that I'd be happy to you know accept your information. And then, I mean, I'll do my own cross-referencing, of course. Um, but I, I think that, you know, one, it, you know, if, if it matches up with my cross reference, it shows you how forthcoming you are, which would be a yeah, good thing for you. Sure. Right. So, um, yeah, go ahead and put it in the back chat, put it, put it in the back or just send me an email through the ones I've got. Well, 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 lie, lie, lie. First of all, before we get into liar, liar, pants on fire, did anybody recognize the little boy hopping across the trampolines? The little bow-legged boy? The little five-foot-five guy there. Yep, wearing his sister's boots. That was speakeasy. <laughs> that is a video of speakeasy hopping across the trampoline park. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I thought it was Ernie. <laughs> well, they looked a lot alike, but Ernie's about two inches taller. So yeah, I'm, I'm just laughing because I wasn't really. I was just listening to you know who the who it was talking, and I see yeah. now again the second time I was like, well, no shit. And then you gave that description, and it still fit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. Now. Let me tell you, first of all, you YouTube reporters, 
been verified, truth finder, and whatever else you pay four or five dollars a month for, twenty dollars a month, some of you, ain't worth a shit. You can pull Ernie's report right now on Truth Finder or been verified. There ain't nothing on it. Nothing. But if you pay $29.95 and do an actual records request, well, then you get what we're going to talk about tonight, Brother Kemper. An actual report. Yep. And it's going to be a thing of beauty. Um, he said it there. He always does. Uh oh, my alarm's going off. Just say. Yeah, he's sitting up there acting like he ain't never done nothing and ain't nothing ever happened with him. And he's such a uh, line walking, outstanding citizen. I mean, it's opposite. Quite the opposite. Just a second. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I might have another video coming for y'all here in a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Um, yeah. Ernie always goes back to that. You know, I ain't got no criminal record. I have no criminal record. Oh, yes, you do. So you can go and have your truth finder and you're being verified. You can pay to have that wiped out. X Factor told us all about that. Um, you know, Ernie probably got one of his minions to pay for him to wipe it out. He ain't got nothing on there. There's nothing on there for Ernie. But yeah. you ready for this, Kemper? You ready to start going over this? Oh, yeah. Me too. Six pages. We'll start at the bottom. That's the oldest. Six pages, Mr. Ernest. Uh, I won't be able to see a whole lot of chat. So I'll pop in. I'll pop back over there every now and then. All right. Down here at the bottom. Now, remember, I, I, told, I think I told you. Did I tell you about the school bus incident one time, Kemper? Um, you mentioned it. But I knew I had remembered that, and I was wondering why it wasn't on his record, but it is on his record. Um, because Ernie, and you'll see it on his record here in a few minutes here. Um, when you had a little uh old cop cars, uh, Crown Victoria, I don't remember what year it was, but it was an old beater, uh, got it off some security guard, um, never you know, had it transferred and all that shit, which you'll see that too. But anyway, Ernie hits a school bus. Runs into a school bus. And let me see if I can make that bigger. There we go. A little bit bigger. Runs into a school bus. Let's see. All right. And what does he do? Well, he flees the scene of the crime. Um, they used to make fun of him because he was driving in his police cruiser thing there, you know, pretending to be a cop all the time. And, <laughs> but the cop car had a big yellow streak all down the fender and down the side door from the school bus. Wow. Ernie. We getting ready to bust you, boy. Let me see if I can make that bigger. Let me go back to the screen over here. Oh, shit. I have trouble. Let's see. There we go. Let me see if I can. Tell me what. No, that didn't help. That's the wrong one. I think there's a. There it is. There it is. Tell me if it's, it's too big, Kimber. Can you see that better? Um, I mean, I'm I'm with my glasses here. Is that too big? Is it come out of the screen or anything? No. Okay. 
All right. So right here at the bottom, we're going to start in uh, oh, 2005. 2005. Uh, originally filed on 52305. Failure to wear seatbelts. No big deal. License to be in possession. No big deal. Disregarding a stop sign. Hmm. All those were dismissed, of course. Then we go to August the 8th, 2005. What do we have? Terroristic threat. Yep. Third degree, brother. Third degree. Uh, it was dismissed, you know, went to court. And the other party agreed to, you know, let it go. Um, he had a bail of $2,000. Partially secured. It was set on August 6th. Um, and then we get down here. Let's see. Don't want to go too far. All right. Leaving the scene of an accident on 923.05. Uh, and failure to render aid or assistance. To a school bus, bro. Ran off. He was sentenced to 90 days. Now, they suspended the sentence. You know what that means. You got probation. Right. For two years, 24 months. Pay fines. Uh... Mm -hmm. He paid five. He, he had a fine of $500. And, of course, he didn't pay it. Fine suspended at 128 Going up here, failure to produce insurance card. Guilty. Look at all these guilties. Uh, he's never been much of a driver or had all these um, certifications. You know, he claims he's driving for all these Bill Clintons and all this stuff. He well, not with this driving record. You didn't, scaring dog. Uh, permit unlicensed motor, uh, unlicensed operator to over operate motor vehicle. Guilty. Court costs $128. We fine $50. License to be in possession. $926. Failure to wear seat belts. Don't like him seat belts, these scare. Uh, one headlight. Probably knocked that headlight out on the school bus. When have we ever known him to wear a seat belt? How many lives have we seen him? Let me do this. How many lives have we seen him do driving without him wearing a seat belt? <laughs> I'm sorry if I missed oh, yeah. anything. I cannot see StreamYard right now, guys. He still hasn't learned. No, he ain't. He don't give a damn. Nope. He's like a child. Like the little boy that hopped across the screen there at the beginning of the show. Um, Fair to maintain, maintain required insurance. Imagine that. Can you imagine if this guy, how much insurance would cost this guy now? Well, if, if he got licensed. I don't think he'll ever get a license again. Now, with everything going on with him right now, yeah. mm -hmm. here we are in 2007, improper equipment, fine $25, one headlight. Uh, up above that, we got no operator's license on a moped, Kemper. Can you imagine a little fella riding a moped like Dumb and Dumber? I could. <laughs> you I think could. easy to ride it with him? Easy to ride it with anybody. He's oh, a little yeah. horse. He is. Yeah. All right. <laughs> He's guilty of all this. You know, uh, instruction permit violations. Those were dismissed. No expired Kentucky registration receipt. No expired reg registration plates. Fines. 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 That's why he's paying on all these fines, y'all. That he's been paying on since 2007. Improper display of registration plates. OBS expired. Temporary plate. 2007. Come up here. Hang on just a second. All right. Let me. I got to check a message. Yeah. Before we get to a certain spot here. One second. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll play that when we get up there. 
All right. Let's see here. Where we at? Um, no, li no license plate not legible. Operating on a suspended or revoked operator's license. No operators, moped license. Ernie, stay off in mopeds, bro. Did you see what I sent you? Uh, did you send me a text? A yeah. picture. Message. Hang on a second. <laughs> Shit. Oh, we'll play it. We'll show that to me to do. <laughs> I haven't posted that one yet, but you said that. I was like, oh, that I is beautiful. Perfect. <laughs> we know who we know who was on the moped with Ernie. If anybody guesses it right, I'll give you a free t-shirt. First one to guess it right. You gotta keep an eye on it, Kimber. Eric is not allowed to vote on that one. Eric can't vote. No. Right. He already knows the answer. So, failure to own, failure of owner to maintain required insurance. Again, failure to produce insurance card. No or expired Kentucky registration receipt. No or expired registration plates. Look at all these fines old boy racked up. No wonder he's still paying on all them fines from 2007. Didn't he say he was going 117 miles an hour or something like that to go check out his kid who got burnt? Something stupid, yeah. I don't see all that. No. Um, Chasing Dick is what he was doing. That's what he was doing. We'll show you here in the moped picture in a minute. <laughs> Failure to produce insurance card on page three. Um, he or he looks like he got a plea deal or or something right here. Uh, disposed as guilty per order per general order entered eleven twenty nine twenty two twenty two. Dude, I mean this dude. This was from two thousand seven, and he started paying on the fine in two thousand twenty two. And Harlan County, he says, you know, does everything by the book. Right. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, 2007, per order waived in 22 again. Operating on a suspended or revoked license. Uh, look, yeah, bail, surety for the amount of $2,000, and his mama bailed him out. But he ain't never been in jail. He ain't got no criminal record, Kemper. Do they put you in jail if you don't have, if you don't commit a crime? Usually, no. I didn't think um, so. Didn't there think is so. a small percentage of people that are convicted of crimes they didn't commit. Right. I mean, a well, lot of circumstances around those situations to make. Yeah, but so. they were suspected. At least suspected. Well, yeah. I mean, if, you, if you're in jail, you've been you got a criminal something on your criminal record. He was telling that lady. Don't even know her name. Don't care to know her name. That he had no criminal record. You can pull his report. He just pulled it six days ago. This one was pulled this morning. Less than a day ago. This, oh, this is when he got his meth charge. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the funny part. Mm -hmm. Madison County. Case number 22M00272. That's a misdemeanor. Uh, Public administrative release. They let him out on his own recognizance. But they won't do that now. <laughs> Posted on 3-122. I remember that day. That day I saw him at McDonald's. No arrest or violations other details in memo. Um, this says why he was arrested. Public intoxication for a controlled substance. Excludes alcohol. It was amended because Ernie pled down to disorderly conduct, second degree. Guilty. He was assessed 90 days, Kemper. Served two of them. And has a uh, conditional. Yep. Yep. Condition. I'm sure, um, like what we saw. In this report, the conditions of his release for a lot of this stuff, he's already violated multiple oh, yeah. times in oh, different yeah. ways. Mm, let's see what's going on. All right. Let me, um, I'm going to pull this up. That was the plea deal. So I'm going to, I'm going to go back. 
stop sharing that for a minute. And I'm going to show you all this one. Y'all having fun yet? We ain't even got to the good stuff yet, Kemper. Good stuff coming next. Let me show you this one. Now, this is, I was told to play this before the plea deal, which I missed it. I'm playing it right after plea deal. Hope it works out that way. I'm sure it will. Uh, I'm going to hide the screen and just listen. Just us. I've never done meth in my life. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, no, everybody saw that when you were cammed up on YouTube, running down the highway, high as fuck, running from the cops. Never done meth in my life. Mm -hmm. You got it, buddy. Okay, Steph, you want me? You wanted me to play this. You can play whatever you want. I mean, there's dozens of videos you can bring up on this retard. Oh, my God. And uh, they told me. He is lying. They told me, they said, you know, Betty Washington, Jimbo, <laughs> all them people, and my no team, Tina, tried to call the people that really cared, him got shot. through to the police, and they seen what was going on. Are That's why they treated this? it the way they this treated guy it. Guy Good has another thing. You know, the other ones, they don't care. Okay. They want the police to pull up on me and just start shooting. He has co-occurring disorders. I got and strawberry ice cream. YouTube's starting to take note of that too. Oh, I'm, is you know, really we have a a representatives oh, you who are seeing this, and they're seeing these controls <laughs> and how they're doing. Oh, are they? All we need is intent. Oh, and once we sense. prove intent, their channels are gone. Really? All of them are gone, and they I hope they'll be arrested where they're supposed to be. <laughs> now, when you see these people like drafting up the lies, and they're bringing people's family in it, and things that happened in the past or something. These people ain't no good. You, you want me to bring her? You want me to bring her past up? I could easily bring her past up on her. Tamari you know is why? a beautiful person. She's not like you. Look at this. She's We're all mad like here. You. This person needs to go. This person needs to go. Thank you, God. Can we you get were this person begging out of here? People to As a matter of fact, Ernie Shell. This person needs to go. We're all mad here. Don't need to even be here. You're saying tomorrow. This person here. I'm gonna put her time You're saying right tomorrow. He's a beautiful person. She took five thousand dollars off people. She scammed five thousand dollars off people. You know what I mean? No, I'm good. Thank you so much. Thank you. Look at this food. I cannot believe this. <laughs> and if anybody doesn't know what I'm talking about. You need to go to General Awareness and watch his channel. No, this is the same stream right. that Benny Keys because came up in the pointing uh, finger at you, right? Before, wow. Mm -hmm. What female? What female? Before Ernie about? went to the hospital. I'm not I, mean, sure. I still need The bread, cops but, even right. said Ernie still doing it. was on methamphetamine. Got about two hours sleep. The cops even said that, didn't they, Ernie? Ernie was begging But you've never smoked meth a day in your life. Never smoked meth. Yeah, but the Thank cops you guys. Thank you. That it was going to give him shot. The to murder him. Murder. They had to change it. To it takes a lot, climate. guys. It does. It takes a lot. And uh, Ernie is nothing. I want to thank than everybody for helping us reach. What are we? Scamming everyone. Fifty nine hundred plus subscribers. And these people in his chat are milking it up. I hate to break it to you, people. But can you pause? Uh, uh, can you pause the video? Chat. Can you pause the video? Yeah, 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 yeah. You Let her speak. Can you pause? Can pause it. She can speak, but we can pause it. And I'm yeah. being 100. So on. let me ask you so much. on the video. On the video, is that is uh who who's the female speaking? And why does it matter? That's you, ain't it? No, it's not. <laughs> it's not? <laughs> nice try. Okay. No, it's okay. not. Well, me. It sounds like you. Are. It really does. Yeah, <laughs> no, it ain't me. Huh? Well, anyways, I don't know. I don't know who it is. No, yeah. don't really good try. Anyways. It ain't me. Okay, good deal. So, what is this? Okay, good. Rachel. She's making a point. The she's cops not shit. said you were high on meth. And they had to the change said. it to disorderly conduct because I proved yeah, it Yeah, no. Uh, yeah, what, because you pled it down. 
because no, I proved it, it was wrong. a plea. Yeah, no, fuck off. I proved it wrong. I proved it wrong. You pled it down. Yeah, whatever. Right, right, act like step, we don't step, know step, how. Time out, time out, real quick, uh, Ernie. Uh, in that case, uh, did did you take it to trial or did you plead out? I, I played. A, I played guilty to the Thank you. Oh, okay, so I, I think. To, I think. I, I think to her point is that you know that would have been arranged within the plea agreement. Well, I was living in New York at the time and having to drive back. To yeah, Kentucky, sure. And they wanted. There's and, always and an they, excuse. And they wanted to do the trial, and I was going to do it because it's only like two days in jail, anyways, and I already spent that. Because I spent yeah, you, time. you would have bailed and ran to another state. No, you, 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 always you do. don't anything. You don't even know what you're talking about. You have no. Yeah, idea. no, I, I know exactly what I'm talking okay, about. So it is whatever. a pattern of behavior. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> Stupid redneck do, piece of shit. Do we have any other uh, clips? There? Show me. Show me where. Oh I'm yeah, we got criminal. plenty. Show oh, me where I'm a convicted plenty. criminal. It ain't by somebody else's word. Oh no, word you just like bail me. to another state. Ernie. Show me. Show me where I'm a convicted <laughs> criminal. Yeah. Uh-huh. And, we're, and, and we're somebody that's oh, not uh, against me or is saying oh, something that's legit. Not against. Okay? Well, you know. Your criminal record might have some. Yeah, he was. Yeah. Yeah, and yeah, the the lady was right. Whole way, she was right. Show me, show me. Pleaded, show me. he pleaded guilty, pleaded down to avoid going to court and getting possible meth charges. So they offered him a plea deal, and he took it. It was smart, um, but he didn't prove nothing wrong. He actually right. told the cop, "I got the citation right here that he does meth." Of course, he said the cop lied. Put a one in the chat if you believe the cop or um, Ernie lied. Put a two in the chat if you think the cop lied. I'm not mad at you, Izzy. How you doing? Hey, I, I got. I'm gonna play something for you, just for Izzy. You find it. No, I got yeah. it. But Ernie, Ernie forgets that he even pled guilty to a couple of those driving infractions too. So that would make it a criminal charge. Yeah, he's 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 pleaded guilty to a lot of stuff because he knows he's guilty. Mm-hmm. Um, and you know, it's it's quicker to take a deal, and get it over with. That's what he should have done with his big charge here, and he did. There we go, easy. <laughs> There you go. Got it. But um, yeah, he's a liar, man. And I, I'm going before we show the rest of his criminal record. I'm going to show you all who was on that moped with Ernie. We've got we've got evidence. It's a pickle. Let me pull it up here. Oh, so fickle. So fickle. Oh yeah. No doubt. There's no doubt. No doubt here, bro. Where'd you get this, man? This had to be hard to get. That's right. I'll share that. You gotta know people, bro. Gotta know. Yeah, I got you. I got I happen you. to know a few people. Not a lot. There y'all go. There he is. On the moped. Dun, 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 dun. Did anybody guess feel? <laughs> Did anybody guess Phil? I didn't see Phil. Um, I forget who it was I seen guessed. Hey Trixie. Nicolina, thank you for the dollar ninety nine super chat. Don't if, don't forget about the tasing in Tennessee. Right. This is only Kentucky. This is only Kentucky. And he's got he was arrested for child support in Virginia. He's been arrested for um, uh, impersonating a cop and yeah. walking around with a baton and a um, hypodermic instrument in, in New, New York. York. And he's yeah. also got criminal trespassing in New York that he's not shown up for in court yet. Yep. So, yeah. and the one in Tennessee, he was obstructing, and he got you know the, the cops, girl. Not, they tased him for it. Yeah, Jonesboro whooped his ass. Not Jonesboro. Yeah. Yeah. Is it Jonesboro? It's, Jonesboro. No, it wasn't Jonesboro. it's uh, La Follette, Jonesboro, or uh, Jacksboro. Jacksboro. 
Jacksboro. I was going to say Jonesboro is over by Davy Crockett. In that yeah, area line. you're right. Yep. Mm -hmm. Jacksboro, La Paul area. We, we used to play in tournaments down there all the time, so I know right where it's at. But, yeah. It is but just that's pretty much – that. that's in between where he was raised and where he was hanging out a lot in the East Tennessee, East Virginia – or West Virginia, um, yep. all that little circle right there where all the states meet. That's how he – gets around he has at least for the three years that i've known of him and quite a few like two or three before that it was a habitual place for him to be around cody huskins uh, around dalton stout around where jimbo's at where um chris was doing his thing you know and of course you know to do what ernie does and to do it in small areas you have to move around like that Otherwise, yep. people are going to just know way too much. You're going to be sunk. It won't be successful. And I ain't saying he's successful right now, but he wouldn't have near the help if he tried it the other way. Yep. So that's why he's, yeah, I'm, I'm sure at least three is possibly four or five states he's got charges in, bro. Yeah. Now we got the juicy stuff in Kentucky coming up. The juicy stuff. Is it on the screen? Um, I can't see it very well. No, it's not. Hmm. I don't think so. Me, what would I do? What would I'm, I do? I've got mine on. Well, that's that's right. Yeah, receiving stolen property, ten thousand. Okay, I can see it. Oh, here I got my. Yep. That's it. There we go. Oh, we got some starred comments. Izzy, thank you for the three dollar super chat. I beat Nick's dono. Ha ha. What? Miss Elaine, are you going to let her do that? <laughs> oh, goodness. Thank you, Izzy. Randy B, $10 super chat. Happy birthday, Kemper. Kemper, I'll thank send you. you thank you. All right. Now, let's get over here to the criminal record. All right, let me find it so I can scroll up. Damn it. There we go. Damn it. Damn it. All right. Original field on 3-28-22. This was the day he went to court uh, for his, you know, when he walked out of the courtroom thinking he's going to be a big badass and tell a bunch of lies, you know, when he actually went there and pled guilty. And he was going to say, you know, they dropped the charges down. They knew I had them. But they arrested him. Mm -hmm. It's third degree. That was dismissed after uh, presented to the grand jury. But he was also arrested that day for theft by failure to make required deposition. That's actually the uh, amended charge. The original yeah. charge is receiving stolen property, $10,000 or more. Ernie will tell you he wasn't charged with that. He was. But... But the OBS theft by failure to make required disposition, um, that is an indictment by the grand jury. So apparently they saw enough evidence to give a solid indictment on that yep. and change what, what he was originally charged with. They sure did. So and for him to run around and say, oh, I got proof it was a setup, blah, blah, blah. No. Because any kind of proof of it being a setup went away with a stolen property, receiving it. And right up here it says, Mr. Shale was bail in the amount of $5,000, was set on 328.22, and posted three days later on 331.22. No alcohol. Here's his conditions of bail. No alcohol or drugs. No new arrests or violations. Other uh, and details in the memo. Um, so he's been arrested since then in New York. That's a violation of his conditions. Mm -hmm. Um, no drugs or alcohol. Uh, he said yeah. he's been seen drinking, bragging about drinking, and he admitted to doing cocaine. Well, I mean, we did hear him snorting the other day, no matter if he had admitted to it or not. We know he was snorting something. Yeah, but that'd be hard to prove in court, but. It ain't hard to prove when somebody says I did cocaine twice. <laughs> you know? That's true. Yeah, you know? I mean, if you're gonna, they're gonna take um, 
recorded stuff in other cases, they might as well take it in the scaring dog case, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Now, and right here, uh, that was case number 22, felony 00271. That's a felony, scaring. And then, yeah. don, don, don. Let me, oh, well. Okay, I mean, you know, I'm not in stream um, on 11 30, 2022. Pending case bail of no bail, or sorry, bail of no bail set. Defendant may not post bond for the amount of zero dollars was set on 1 12 2023. What happened on 1 12 2023, Kemper? Well, sir, we were sitting in that Madison County courtroom. We got to watch everything puss out and not show up and send us. Poor lawyer in there. We got video of that business man. with no evidence whatsoever of you being sick, Ernie. Even the judge said it right when she looked at it. Like this is old. You got something new? Mm -hmm. And he didn't. He had a picture of a picture that you sent him. That's right. Thank you, Say V. Member for one month. Happy birthday, Kemper. Thank you, cousin Trixie. Happy you, birthday man. to you. Happy birthday to you, Kemper. Happy birthday to you. In my best. <laughs> Thank you, Trixie. Yeah, let's show the little courtroom thing here because I think it's important, you know. I mean, this is what we're talking about tonight. I have no criminal record. Right, Kemper? No criminal record. Well. Except for. The criminal record that we're looking at. Record. We went to court. Same. Well, I have a YouTube video that where he's speaking with a gentleman saying he's in Texas and seeking advice on how to avoid consequences for failing to appear in court in Kentucky. So I see your letter and raise you a YouTube video. Uh, Judge Mass. I have a picture of this letter. It is odd to have someone just remaining in a hospital for an undetermined amount of time. Judge, I know that one doesn't. The picture of the letter that I have, I was like, well, I don't have the facts because I guess he had already sent it to court. It's, it's like that. So it does have the, it looks like the actual. What's the request of Conwell? Warrant of arrest. Uh, that was from January 2nd, that letter. Uh, we are now 10 days past that with not updated medical proof. The defendant has failed to appear. A warrant of arrest. He's posted 5,000. Mm -hmm. What? Picture of a picture. Yeah. I, while you're in. I thought he was going to prove you were set up, Ernie. That's what he well, said. The grand jury saw it. Well, the grand jury saw enough to say no. No, that's not the right charge. From what we're seeing, this is the right charge, and he's definitely guilty of this. He's that's why he's indicted for it. That's right. what he don't get. That's why I said if there was any room to say, oh, there was a setup, that would have been that angle. But you're way fucked on that one now. Grand that's jury right. done pinned you, boy. All right. Now. Oh, damn, that's sick. Now. Thanks. We go to. Case filed on April the 5th, 2023 in Madison County. That's case number 23CR criminal 00206. Bail of cash. The amount of $1,000 was set on 5523 and posted. Not, not available. Active bench warrant 552023. And then we come down here to 4523. Bail jumping first degree. On a felony charge, that makes your bail jumping a felony, too. Yep, Class D felony. Yep. Uh, and you you do have your theft by failing to make required disposition of property, $10,000. Basically giving cost. your van back to the owner like you were supposed to without damage. Yeah, instead of driving down the road, getting out of it, and saying you're having a frequency attack. Yeah. yeah. All your friends saying, get away from the van, Ernie. You're yeah. under attack. Really? I don't, I don't think the judge is going to, or the jury would, would believe that, that the van was talking to you, Aaron. That's, that's not going to be within a reasonable doubt. 
<laughs> so, records unit, Frankfort, Kentucky. There's a phone number. Uh, you all can get these records for yourself if you call them up or go online and get them. Like our great member here, I don't know if she wants her name mentioned, but we appreciate it. Uh, and this is an actual record. Uh, what you all see on these truth finders and being, being verified, that's not a record. Not at all. Um, like people say that I ain't never held down a job. That's horseshit. I know mm -hmm. I fucked up. It ain't on being verified. It ain't on truth finder, but I know I did. I know what I did. I'm not going to tell YouTube because fuck them. Let them look it up. Let them find it. They're good, right? These these little apps y'all using ain't worth the shit. All right. Ernie has docked some lady to hell and back saying it's Beth Dutton. And it ain't. Just a second. No, I didn't even know Mama T went live, Nick. But for her to go pissing on her live stream today, didn't wash her hands. Well, she's the same girl that was having a little stream yard meeting and slipped in her own dog's piss into a puddle. Got up, didn't wash off, didn't say, hey, guys, I got to go clean up, nothing. She just sat there and continued the conversation. So, I mean, I'm not expecting her to wash her hands after her own filth. I'll give it to you. Okay. Mama T. And I appreciate you, um, you know, let me ask because he has no idea that I did this. I did this on my own. So, yeah. Well, thank you, little Kimmy. I try. I try. She did right then. Did you hear that? Mm hmm. This is that. He has no idea that I did this. I did this on my own. So, yeah. Nasty. Well, thank you, little Kimmy. I try. I try. Why didn't she mute? Gross bitch. Is it Sherry's man? Why didn't she mute? Because it's my damn it, man. It don't matter to her. I feel my damn brain up tonight. I ain't ate supper yet. Well, let's pay back for those. Uh, Ernie taking three at once pictures, bro. Nicolina, I'm mad at you now. Everybody wants me to be mad at you? By God, I'm mad now. You shouldn't have done me that way. I'm coming after you, Nicolina. Oh. It's funny. And on Kemper's birthday, God's sake. Thank you. Happy birthday to Kemper. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Like I said, that's karma. Fuck karma. From you sending those damn email pictures of Ernie's. No. Mm -hmm. I don't lie. I ain't no reason to lie. Lie and get you nowhere. What? Was that Ernie? Was that Ernie? I didn't do nothing. I didn't do nothing. I didn't do nothing. I didn't do nothing. Nothing. Why are you doing nothing? Ernest, listen, calm down, okay? I didn't do nothing. Okay, listen, they're gonna help you. Just, just listen to them. Listen to what they're telling you, okay? I got your Facebook live. I'm not wrong on this, please. Please help me, Facebook. That might be the most famous line Ernie's ever said. Mm -hmm. Please help me, Facebook. Donna's Journey and Chit Chat, member for 16 months. Happy birthday, Kemper. Thank you, Donna. Y'all getting here late? Y'all, Nick Leaner set me up. Set Thank me you, up. Nick. Spread the word. <laughs> well, I mean, we can, only gross, expect so much. We, we can only expect so much from Mama T anyway. Why did she mute? She's got worms, bro. I mean, what do you expect? That and the fucking mange? Dude, all you got to do is hit the damn mute button. Yeah, hit it. But, but she's feral, so. Well, hey, Mo. Ah, man. Yeah, my Facebook. That's right. Oh, Lord. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, so that's you, a good ass record though, bro. Yeah, I liked reading that today. Yeah. So that is the official Kentucky record of Ernest. He's done something. Jody probably helped him do it to clear off the truth finder and been verified. Um, but you can't do that with your real record. And this is America, not Canada. Speak easy, or we'd have yours. Um, I got some videos about old Speak Easy. We're gonna be breaking out with here pretty soon. But oh Lord, that boy, five foot five, dude, five foot five, maybe five foot four. He's little. Christina's five two and a half, and I got a picture of them standing next to each other, and he's maybe inch, maybe two inches taller than her. Maybe if he's wearing his platforms, he's a little bit taller, but, you know, sort of like Ernie with his stacks. Yeah. Just, but we're used to the little man and little man syndrome, bro. You know? Litter box break. Mama T needed it. She went to litter box. She probably wouldn't hurt all that, would she? Because he hit the water. I heard the gravel. Hey, pit bull mama. Member for 12 months. Hey, 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 fam. Good to see y'all. Love you all. Finally get to catch a lie. We're glad to have you, Pitbull Mama. Hope your husband's doing good. I've been praying for y'all. Yeah, five foot five and a size 12 shoes that don't fit. There ain't no way he wears a size 12. And for all you idiots that say there was two sets of footprints at the crime scene, I'm just going to tell you now. Y'all know what fucking crime scene I'm talking about. There wasn't any footprints at the crime scene. Not one set, not two sets. And I wear a size 13. So none of them little midgets can wear my shoes. And I couldn't wear none of them little midget shoes. None of them. Yeah. If Easy had size 12s, that'd be half his fucking body length, bro. Right. There's no way he wears a like, Not even proportionate, man. So. Wears an 8. I believe that, Nicolina. I believe that. Yeah, I could see that. Like Ernie's like a seven or eight. Toxic. Have, did oh. you see the video of Easy hopping across the uh, trampolines? Toxic said, "How fucking embarrassing uh, to buy big shoes and make the women think yeah, <laughs> dude is as dumb as Cyrax." It reminds me of Tyrese Need. I don't know who Tyrese Need is, but if Easy reminds you of him, I don't want to know. <sighs> that guy's a joke, man. Easy's a total joke. Ernie's a total yeah. joke. And they, Ernie's always talking about being a leader, bro. What the hell is he leading? Bobby. Is it a size eight men's, a size seven women's? I think so. I think it's pretty close, yeah. What? What? Is he leading a Mickey Mouse club? Look at that dude. That dude said Ernie is seriously tiny. He wears a six and a half, I believe he said one time. He's a tiny little feather now. Um, I've heard Ernie admit to eight and a half, but that's the lowest I've ever heard him admit to. But yeah. we also know people have reported his shoes being smaller than that. Hunter gave so, him a size nine of them Jordans. Yeah. Uh, or Air, they're Air Force Ones, what they were. Because Ernie said, you know, we only, he gave me Walmart shoes. No, I didn't, motherfucker. For one, if you got Walmart shoes from me, you should have been grateful you had, I bought your shoes. Right. But I didn't. Hunter, my son, gave him a pair of nice Air Force Ones. Nice Nike shoes. And they were size nine. They were old. Yeah. Yep. Hunter took good care of them. He's got all kinds of shoes in there he's took good care of. Um, he's got them shoes that lace up themselves and everything, bro. Yeah. But, they, you know, they don't fit him anymore. So he gave Ernie that pair. He didn't want to. I was like, Hunter, Hunter give it to him. He's, he's, he needs some shoes. So he he gave him that pair of shoes, and those were nines, and they were big on him. I mean, big on him. Yep. You can see his foot in them uh, in those pictures. He looks like a clown. Well, hey, Nightbot. Nightbot says, become a member and get all the membership perks, including the customized emojis in the chat. Y'all show them some of them customized emojis. We got some new ones. Members-only videos and more. Earn saying his record has nothing on it, and we speak as we speak. Ellie Mayo, is he really? 
He's a lying son of a bitch, Buffy. Buffy. He's a liar. Look here, Nightbot said, we got close again. If the stand gets 300 in chat, we'll give away one free T-shirt. Y'all had a chance to get a T-shirt now. All you had to do was guess feel on the back of that moped. That is a terrific picture, by the way. That is just, that made my night. That was, that might erase the Mama TP. Well, I was going to say, um, I did post one a few weeks ago. It was Ernie and Phil together, Broke Back Mountain. So, <laughs> um, and that was the other one that was created that day. So, Oh, yeah. I like the moped yeah. one. The moped one was perfect tonight for his record, right? Well, when you said that, can you see him on a moped? And I was like, yes, I can, actually. <laughs> so yeah, you sure as hell did. Uh, yeah. That was perfect, bro. That was perfect. When I saw that, man, my, my freaking face lit up. I was like, well, these, that was perfect. I thought you made it on the fly like that. No, it's you been there for Queen? Weeks. Gotcha. Queen Ashley. Uh-oh. T-shirt. I got I got a Queen Ashley T-shirt in there in the envelope right now, sitting on the table. I need to get it out. Better. She sent somebody I, after you. You're on your own. Thumbbreakers come looking for me. Oh, that's what she do. She don't hey, play. Sandy. Ernie is a liar for hire. His supporters provide his income for lying to them. Ain't it crazy? Ain't it crazy? Look, I'm I'm over it. Let them idiots give them all the money in the world, and let them be responsible. When he ends up, you know, with a hot shot or whatever they call him, and he's laying in the ditch somewhere, or you know, somebody takes advantage of him and leaves him laying face down in the ditch somewhere. Don't blame the fucking trolls. Don't blame the trolls. We tried our best to get him where he needs to be. He needs to be in jail, getting help. You you to give him money, that's on you. That's on you. When he he's going out clearly buying drugs. Clearly, and you keep feeding him. Yeah, ignorant. ignorant. See, I don't need to be doing like that meerkat in my avatar. Put the whooping on his ass. Stop enabling him. It'd be a lot better off, and it happened a lot sooner. People would just stop, let him take himself down, where he'd go get his shit fixed. Now he's gonna have to pay some price for all the shit he's done, yeah, but the longer he stays away from it, the less likely that's going to be an option for him. Because he ain't going to be on the run for 10 years, guys. He's not going to be on the run for two. I streamed the wrong thing. I'm chasing. He's not going to be no Whitey Bulger. You know, ain't going to be no dumb shit like that. But he will... He, he will end up having to pay a price. This is going on right now. Right now. But I figured I'd come in and talk to you guys. So what's going on over Jimbo? Are you playing a trial again? <laughs> nope. Over the vampire. They sent him those fire. Oh my god. I thought you said you had pizza. No. No. I got some much more better than pizza. Relaxation, rest, peace. Oh no eat. Literally. Place pretty much place to my own. Mm. Love it. Beautiful, beautiful place. Oh, yeah, he's tore up right now. Mm -hmm. He's showing your record. I ain't got nothing on it. <laughs> I got disorderly conduct and uh, terrorist threatened or something. That's it from years oh. ago. But a disorderly conduct a couple years ago. Oh, you got an indictment of the grand jury. Show me why I got a criminal, criminal record. Fucking stupid. What's well, criminal criminal, criminal record this morning? Okay, cool. I don't care. It's jail it's criminal act. It ain't nothing. I don't care. Well, if it ain't nothing, go turn yourself in and show us it's Our nothing. Ain't got no blemishes hardly on it. Record ain't got no blemishes on it. Huh? Oh. Record ain't got no blemishes on it. The no, one that we just saw was a few blemishes, actually. 
No, he I thinks they're happened. nothing. He wants to say that they're nothing charges. He's like criminal, criminal. Like I ain't dumb, Ernie. Yeah, it's like this. Like, let's show you the easy hopping in and hopping out at, right before Ernie says this stuff right here. It's easy. You can't use, you can't, you I, can't I, take a you can't take a criminal and use that as a fact. You can't use that as a fact. There's you're no, a criminal. No, I give you credit for coming. You're up a here. criminal. Yeah. What do you yeah. mean? You how are a I, criminal, Ernie Shell. How am I a criminal? How many times you've really? been tased? Do you have a record? No. Yes, you do. Oh, really? No, I don't. I, I've got my you're record. You're full of I, shit. No. Yeah, you post that in a You're full of shit. You record. absolutely have a record. So do well, not stand it. up here and tell me that you cannot take somebody's record into account when it comes to their credibility. Uh, can I can I send you my uh, file? Can I send you my background? Record? I don't know. I already have your file. Okay, then pull everybody it. has your file. Screenshot. It's all over the fucking internet. All, all you're doing is running <clears throat> your mouth right now. Show your proof. Yeah, sure. All I'm doing is running my mouth. I just your had file my rant, is all I just had over my rant the fucking six days ago. Yeah, no, I just you just blame it on PTSD. Is what you. Ernie. Again, again, there's yeah, no, no you're not guilty of anything because well, you have an active warrant, Ernie. Stress. Don't you? You have an active show warrant. Me, show me, show me where I'm guilty of it. Show me where I'm, 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 I'm uh, guilty of anything. I'm yeah, no, show me where I'm convicted. Blame it on your brother. Blame it on PTSD. Blame it on whatever. Yeah. Show me, show me where I'm convicted. Give me a minute. Of anything. I got you, Ernie. I have a, I have, I have, I have two misdemeanors on me. That's it. Oh. Ernie, that's it. Ernie, I'd like, to, I'd like to ask you a question. Yeah, go ahead. You do know who Turtle Boy is, right? Uh, Turtle Boy? No, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. All right, well, I was trying to make a build up to a joke, but I'll just say this: I have almost <laughs> twenty felony charges on my background, and I'm about the most honest motherfucker that you'll ever meet. So don't be saying that all criminals, you know, fucking are liars, because it's total bullshit. The truth is, he doesn't have any convictions yet because he hasn't shown up to court. So, yeah, no, but he has shown up to court and he's just extended it. He's given okay. up excuses. We've all seen it because it's all been out on YouTube. I don't know okay. what fucking game he's trying to play. Like, it's all been out there. And he's like, who the fuck are you trying to email. Send me an email. Send me an email. Do you have a felony theft uh, conviction on you? Felony theft? Who, me? Yeah. No. Okay. Send me, send me your email. If you send me an email, I'll send you my damn... Uh, uh, will, report will, that was just pulled here six days ago. It's not hard to pull your report. Well, you have me. a failure to appear, failure to appear. It's Actually, I would, for, if it was me, I'd rather pull the report myself I would rather than it, it being handed to yeah. me because rather I don't trust anyone shit. word for it. Well, I mean, it's I, from I from tend to go, and, uh, it's just verified. like any good reporter. It's just like any good reporter. You go and investigate yeah. it yourself. Uh, yourself. I'll tell, I'll tell, I'll tell we you don't get it from you. Ernie. Can I send you my? We'll, we'll get it ourselves. You did get arrested for felony theft, on, but guys. you haven't shown up yet. Ernie, uh, if, you, if, if you look in the back, actually, uh, I do have an email here. I'm going to provide you. Uh, I would be happy to actually have uh, you send that over so I can cross reference it with. Can I also send? Can I also cross send reference it? My brother, training and all that. Dude, yeah, you can send it all over you would like. Absolutely. Nobody gives a fuck about it. I do actually. I think this. I don't know. Yeah, because he's done anything. Um, but but I think my point is that I'd be happy to you know accept your information and then I mean I'll do my own cross referencing of course, um, but I, I think that you know one it, you know if if it matches up with my cross reference it shows you how forthcoming you are which would be a yeah, good thing for you sure. right so um, yeah go ahead and put it in the back chat put it put it in the back or just send me an email to the ones I've got. Air hopped away easy. Skeezy. El Kennedy. Scared. Easy likes to make fun of you. Bro. Hulu. Is. Did you see that little dumbass hop across that um, trampoline park? Isn't he a little old to be trampoline parking? I would think. Zero. He's talking all that shit on El Kennedy, how she's too old to be doing hula hoops. Narcissistic said he's a little squirrel that doesn't believe uh inequality because he blocks anyone that disagrees out his lies anyone that says he says wrongs him yep absolutely kyle said <clears throat> ernie said last night that he was api while he was talking to candace that's in 2022 ernie's same commission 
in Tennessee gives out license for bounty hunter. Oh, it's bounty hunter and PI are not the same. No, they're not the same. They're not bounty hunter and PI is definitely not the same. Um, I think that happened last night, L. Kennedy. Right, Kipper? Do you know? I think that video yeah. was last night. <clears throat> what video? The video with Ernie up on that panel line. Just now. I think so. Yeah, I think so. Uh, if Nana Kim or not, I'm sorry, Nana C eight twos in here. She'd know for sure. I believe it was. The embodied you said on his live the introduced. Huh? I was going to say he said earlier on his live stream today that he had done that panel. Yeah. Last night. Jimbo, did you hear him say on his live that he introduced you to MMA? I don't doubt it. He didn't introduce me to MMA. Um, in 1993, um, when I, that's when I started watching MMA. 96, uh, 93, when I started in 97, I actually went and did some seminars with Hoist Gracie himself. Um, and I had never met Ernie. Ernie didn't introduce me to shit. Um, now, did he have a attempt at MMA before I did? Yes, he did. He failed miserably, and he talked shit about me. Because he rented my ring, and he tried not to pay me. So I yeah. told my guys to take down the ring. When he didn't pay me, um, we took down the ring and he's and made him pay and he talked shit. So I started my own MMA. Did I know a lot about it, about promoting it? No, I didn't. Neither did Ernie. But my show was the most successful show in Kentucky history. You know, over 150 successful MMA shows. Verified. You can verify every one of mine. Ernie is a lying piece of shit. Mm-hmm. Nicolina going to bed. Nicolina said, great live, y'all. Happy birthday, Kemper. Going to try and get some sleep. Good night, Nicolina. Thank you, Nick. She sung happy birthday to me, Kemper. I ain't trying to rub it in or nothing, but. <laughs> ain't any boo boo. Uh, I bet when Ernie sits on the couch, his feet don't touch the floor. He's so little, and I didn't even, I didn't realize he's barely over five feet tall. Oh, that hopping across the thing there, that dude, that's easy. He's barely I, over I, five feet tall. See, I ain't the only one that thought it was Ernie. Ernie's a little bit taller. Ernie's a little bit taller than Easy. <laughs> Ernie's like five six, five seven. Easy's like five four. <laughs> They're sad. Hang on, I got a picture. Him and uh, Christina together. I don't think she get mad at me. Yep. Here we go. Christina is 5'2". Okay? Bear in mind. Christina's 5'2". What do you, how tall do you think easy is? They're standing up. About five, five, maybe five, six. Tops, right? Five, five. Yeah. 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 I don't know if he's three inches taller than her or not, bro. Well, I'm just giving the 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 lean. The yeah, the the thought of him being in front of her a little bit and how it might be at an angle or whatever. You know, you know, just trying to be objective at the view that I've got. But between see. three and four inches is what I'm seeing. We got another one. Let's see this. Yeah, the other one, he looks a little taller, but he's got half. Yeah, there was always had some. So do his shoes, too, though. Yeah. Yeah, he's probably wearing big sneakers, you know, side blades. Yeah. Yep. Him and Ernie are both known to wear big shoes, whether it be tennis shoes or boots. They both there like those. Is. There he is. Yeah, he's he's about three or four inches. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't Christina a doll? She's she's yeah. just a doll, ain't she? He's an idiot. That's what I know. Look, look how cleaned up he was, man. Back then, he don't look like a fool like he does now, right? <laughs> right, dude. He's trying. He's he's trying to adopt a style that's 
gaudy and it's basically yeah. a shit ton of other styles put all together which makes it worse makes it more yeah. gaudy so hey, between John. the hair the earrings the tattoos um the clothes the way he wears his clothes like all of that is it screams thirst for attention look at me look at me self-absorbed this not is, much that's good this is what he is maybe uh let me ask her she might answer that she's probably been to a ride with him um sleazy has to be measured at the fair before he can go on the big boy rides let me ask her that quick well, he may have issues now they not I know, but most rides are at least four to four foot ten inches, I think is what it is. But which at four foot ten be pushing right in his area. <laughs> Here we go. Jimbo. See the comments. Oh, man, I'm not being in the fire. Hey Christine, I just messaged you. <laughs> yeah, she started laughing. I guess she was listening. <laughs> No way you want to like take what I said about her being a doll and try to make something nasty out of it. Yeah, e either that or some stacks or whatever, Miss Horse yeah. Whispers. I guarantee you, at least the tennis shoes and the boots make up an inch to their height. Yeah. If I'd say more. he's 5'5", five five, a stretch taller than Ernie. Ernie said he's 5'3", that he wears fillers to make him look taller. He showed what he puts in his boots. Did he? I didn't know that. Does well, he I know that he, he likes to wear a lot of long sleeve shirts and bracelets and shit like that to make his arms look bigger than what they are because he's so fucking small. The so hat this, gains some advantage for him, too. That's why he yeah, does Yeah, his hat's popped up there pretty good. Mm -hmm. um, she said, yeah, I'm listening, but both boys still awake. Tough, so a little busy. That's cool, you yeah. Look at look at mama taking care of her kids. Easy wouldn't know nothing about it. Yeah, being a good mom. And I'll tell you what, buddy. Being there, we're like I was gonna say Hunter had an issue tonight. And he's 17 years old. Uh, Leslie was I was on the phone with Leslie and she heard it, you know, like um but I was there for my boy, you know. Um mm. the good stuff, the bad stuff. It, it's all, it's all about love, man. You can't like you, you, once it's gone, you can't get it back. The the time, like next year, he won't be seventeen no more, and then the following year, he won't be eighteen no more. You know, it's, it goes away, and you know, when they're young like that, it's just every moment is so precious. He's missing it, bro. Autism brings sleep issues too. Yes, it does. I've heard that before. Ernie puts lifts in there. I can't believe I give him money either, Fluffy. Crazy to me. Crazy to me. It doesn't help. He's still a tiny little fella. He is a little fella, ain't he? Speaking of little fellas, he's sitting over here with 50 in his chat talking about P. Diddy. <laughs> P. Diddy? Yeah. Oh, it's tough, but well worth it. Yes, it is. It is worth it. I know. That's funny. Thank you, narcissistic. Um. So, man, man, when we got that report today, I man, I, my eyes lit up. I'm like, we're gonna have fun with this. I have no criminal record. I ain't got nothing. No, he's still a worse than I ain't got nothing. No. <laughs> yes, it does, Ernie. Yes, it does. Always has. That's the thing. He's been saying that for years, and he's had these for years. Oh, that terroristic threatening or whatever. That was that 2008 or something, 2007, something like that. Yeah. Six. I know it was five. It was five, I think. Okay. Well, even more. That's just more years to add to it. Yeah. Um, Christina said 50 some fame. Yeah. Uh, Robo Granny, Christina, says you are after Easy's fame, that you didn't want him first. Three and a half years, but now that he's famous, you want him. Yeah. She's a smart one. Leslie, MF at B. L M A O, leave my boy alone. Bless his heart. 
Are you talking about Ernie? Come on now, let's pick on Ernie. Let us pick on Ernie. Kim Louise and Christina, we appreciate your efforts. Hey, Kim Louise. Well, now there's proof. There's a receipt. That's right, Nana CA2. Receipt. That that was awesome. That was just... I, I, I knew I remembered he hit that school bus, bro. I knew it. And I didn't yeah. know how in the world to prove it. I looked for Facebook posts. I went back digging and digging. Couldn't find nothing. But now, leaving the scene of an accident, I remember it. And we got you on that urn. Mm -hmm. And a school At bus. Oh, cause Tom. Yeah. A school bus. Like, what if a kid had been hurt? Yeah, Ernie. Piece of shit. Who hits a school bus and runs off, bro? Well, the same person that runs down the highway and ask Facebook to help him and Shelby show not to shoot him. I mean, <laughs> same person, apparently. <laughs> That's about it. Miss Horse Whisper said, one day my son was being a normal, rebellious teenager. Seemed like the next day he was expecting his first child and his baby was born way too early. You know what? I ain't, I ain't got to experience that yet. <clears throat> but um, I kind of dread it. But I kind of look forward to it. You know, um, I do want grandbabies. I do want, you know, snuggles and hugs. I see that little boy of Christina's man. He, you know, you know, he's just a hugger, man. You know, yeah. Um, yeah. it's just kids are the world, bro. And these people that talk shit all the time about kids and don't do nothing except talk. Yeah. They should be gone. They shouldn't have no platform. Do something or shut the fuck up. Leslie said, you better hide, better fo hide, Jimbo. I was talking about the hunter. Oh. You wasn't talking about Ernie? Kimper. Mm. Watch my back. I gotta run. For what? Leslie's coming after me, bro. Well, if you fucked up, you fucked up, dude. I don't, you gonna make me face it like a man? <laughs> Hell with that. Well, you That's know, it's ability. There you go. Everybody's been wanting me and Leslie to fight, too. I guess here it is. Come on, Leslie. Put him up. Put him up. You might be meaner than me, but... But... I'll think so. I'll think so. So was Ernie still alive? Huh? Is Ernie still alive? I don't yep, know. I guess so. Yep, he is. <laughs> hey, Mystery Sky. You ain't too awful late. Just iron 18 minutes. <laughs> oh. Paisley said, Christina, uh, your video of Little B in the puddle was price. Oh, it was, wasn't it? It was. It was. That's right. China doll. No excuse for not getting a job. There's jobs everywhere, man. Yep. Jobs everywhere. Go get one. Stop that. All these people living off the government, man, that, that are healthy enough to work. It drives me crazy. Yep. Drives me oh, crazy. I, agree. I went to the ATM uh, on the first day of the month. And I had to wait in line. And um, they have them little green direct express cards for people on disability and some other things, you know, but they're government issued bank is what it is. And there was a man in front of me. He sat there and pulled out a thousand dollars. No, it was yeah, 400, 400, 200. After got the last 200, it was my turn. And he had the digital receipt up there. It was a little screen. Mm -hmm. The dude had seven thousand dollars in the bank on one of those government issued cards, and he had just took a thousand out. Like, no wonder people won't work, man. Yeah. Why would you? I mean, hell, if I was laying back on seven, seven, or eight thousand dollars a month, I would just I'd chill out, bro. 
live life and love it. Yeah. Well, I get it, man, but I don't even try to investigate that kind of shit. I just go to work. <laughs> Fuck it. I wasn't investigating. I was just about sitting behind him in the ATM line, you know? No, no, I get it. I'm saying I, to go and seek that kind of shit out, I don't take the time to do that. Right, right. It's just not something that I'm actively seeking or looking for. I figure, you know, system says you're going to have to work and supply for yourself and how well you live depends on how much you do for yourself. So, There you go, Paisley. Today is Kipper's birthday. If you'd like to send him a gift, there's his cash app. And he didn't get to work today, so he didn't get to earn no money at work like he normally does. It's his day off, and his day off is his birthday, and he's here where I'm staying. So if, you got you? Dollar, if everybody in chat would send him $2. <laughs> Some bullet pops or something, man. Right, Ernie, right? If everybody in chat would send me $2. Cosmic brownies, bullet pops, whatever. Yeah. Cosmic brownies are popular around the internet. Popular. Narcissistic time. Jimbo, I said the same to my boyfriend the other day. Why would they work if they're getting higher government payout, right? And and a lot of those that get all that kind of money, they also get housing like HUD or whatever and, um, or something else. They, there's so many people that cheat the system. Oh, and the dude, the dude had food stamps too because they went over there and they got a bunch of um, pop. That's what I call it. And, mm -hmm. but um you know like a bunch of 24 packs him and his girlfriend or wife whoever she was and they they look kind of like you know ernie like they looked homeless but they had all that money in the bank no bro no he probably been working somewhere under the table making more money yeah a lot of people do that man Chris Green, I said, I got a whole new kidney. I was back to work in six weeks. You do what you got to do. Yep. That's amazing, Trish. God bless you, and I'm glad I'm glad it worked. Yeah, I was going to say, man, like I was given six weeks of workers' comp, smashed my safe or my uh, thumb in a safe door. The safe mm -hmm. door was from about two inches thick, and it ripped it off in the door. And I went, got it sewn back on. Went back and closed down my shift that night. Did my deposit, all that stuff. They took my days off for that week and the ones from the one coming up. They put all my days off in a row. And after four days, I went and asked them if I could come back to work. I was stir crazy. Yeah. I wasn't going to make it sitting there for six weeks at my house. I needed I to work. Yeah. So they basically made me uh, do the daily functions that I would have to do. And show them that I could do it without hurting myself. There you go. But I mean, I'm just I'm I'm wired differently from yep. people, you know, the way a lot of people are. Because other yep. people would have taken those six weeks and just blah blah blah. You know what I mean? Like end of story. Yeah, Susie Q. I know it's uh, Social Security depends on how much you paid in, but um, also if you got a bunch of kids that are on SSI, each one of them gets close to a thousand dollars. So I don't I don't know if they had kids or whatever, but you know, um, typically, you know, I ain't never seen nobody earn enough to get seven thousand dollars on Social Security a month. That's a lot of money. Yeah, you know? that, that is somebody a lot. Spending some high dollar stuff, you know. Yeah. There might be a limit. I don't know. Is there a limit? I'm sure there is. Yeah. Narcissistic times. Working through uh, gives something for, for mind and growth. Feels good to be productive and a contributor. Learn discipline, gain self-esteem, internal strength, maturity, empathy, patience, and much more. That's right. Do you think Mama T could have read that? No. She'd still be reading it. She'd be about halfway right now. But Ernie. Like she's got to clap that shit out, sound it out. She's got issues when it comes to those big words. Mm -hmm. 
Jimbo Kemper, the stand. Good night. We'll catch rest on replay. Good night, full moon. Thank you for stopping in. It's always good to have full moon. When we go on late, she's she can't come in a whole lot, but she is a longtime supporter. Glad to have her. And I consider her a friend too, off the of YouTube. So um, I've known her for a long time now. Self respect equals working, work for your living. That's right. That's right. You feel better, you know. You're out there earning the paycheck, and you get that paycheck. When I was young, man, you get a paycheck that was big, and you're like, oh, yeah, I did that. I mean, like, easy, right? I did that. I did that. <laughs> it feels good. It feels good. Earth Angel said, it. sadly, today, too many are giving up and making a good life for themselves before they even start. They do, really. They do. Mm-hmm. Paige would give anything to work, be able to work. But I was told at a very young age, my brain injury would make that impossible, but I do things I love to do to make money, and that's working with dogs. Well, that's great, Paige. That's great. Skunk Ape said the max you can get in Social Security is around 3500 Well, yeah. So that's a, that's a pretty good chunk. Um it is a good chunk. You have to pay in a lot, though, you know? I think they take, like, two or three years and somehow and average them. I don't know if it's top year earning and bottom year earning and something else. And I don't know exactly how it works, but it's kind of an average of something, I think, um, instead of the total amount that you work, you know? Which is kind of crazy because, well, I don't know, because some people might work and then get crippled early and outdraw what they paid in. So I paid a lot of taxes, despite what these morons say. More, uh, more than I think was fair, to be honest with you. <laughs> Stormy Skies, there's my beautiful angel. I was getting worried about you. Hey, Stormy, good to have you in here tonight. On Kemper's birthday. Sorry, Kemper. Birthday. I pronounced it wrong, bro. I think you muted, bro. Um, are you talking? Easy's Peppy. Yeah. I was muted, yeah. Stepped away, didn't you? Yeah. Sorry. At least you didn't pee on screen, right? Anybody hear Mama TP? <laughs> Nicolina sent that to me. I'm going to play it for y'all. What do you like? No, I've got manners, man. Like, literally, the only time my phone's in the bathroom is when I'm taking a shower and I put it down by the sink to play music. Yeah. Like, when I, when I go to use the bathroom, my phone's not with me. Yeah. I mean, I know that's abnormal for most people, but... Um, that that's one thing I know that you'll never see me do is um, either unmuted or with the mic or the camera on uh, using the bathroom will never happen because <laughs> there's just not an opportunity for that to happen. Lady Jane Rogue, no, we we did not pee with Kemper, but we we will pee with Mama T. Listen to this. Sorry. But as soon as I get it, I'll give it to you. Okay. And I appreciate you, um, you know, let me ask because he has no idea that I did this. I did this on my own. So, you know. Well, thank you, little Kimmy. I try. I try. That's so nasty. Nasty ho. That's so nasty. And you know it came out of that Sasquatch looking Walking Dead looking yep, that Regaloid. Yep. Probably Shredded probably like neon green. Yuck. Yeah. Mm. Our thing said it's disgusting. I agree. I agree. I won't play again, y'all. 
I'm gonna send it to Kimper. I'm gonna make a video and tell no, you're not. You'll you'll never be able to communicate with me again. You pull that when he shit. Plays it, he's gonna get the I'll shut down all lines. Hey, mystery lady said, "Love all the mods and family here at the stand. We love you, mystery lady. We love you." Demo called you the other day. She tried to. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I won't play it again, Mr. Lady. <laughs> so you get getting her I'm sick. So I'm trying to make people sick on Kimber's birthday. Birthday. Let's, let me check something right Probably here. so, Fluff. So is that guy, G2K? I have no idea who that is. Some dude on Ernie's panel. I think Some guy that, on Ernie's panel? Yeah, I think. I don't know if that's the Aaron dude or not. It sort of looks like him. Well, boys, I'll tell you what. Easy is killing it over there. Is he? Is he, is he, is he got 45? 43, baby. 43. Yeah. Oh, Woo! Way to go, big ease. Way to go. I want to He's taking a vacation that. from drama for his own mental health. Let's see who's on Skarns' panel. Let's check him out. Oh my God, G Two K. Who's that? You might know. I, I I don't know if that's that Aaron dude or not. I mean, he's wearing a flat bill hat like Aaron does, and. Oh, the guy that uh, the shoe guy and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah the guy that probably. everybody like purchased the entire wish list for, and then you know, you see what he's done since. So yeah. yeah it's not, I don't know if that's the same dude or not, but it, it, I get that feeling, that vibe. Oh my gosh. Listen to what these freaks are talking about, bro. Oh, I didn't unmute it. I have no idea. I just heard I'm his voice for a second. I'm going to show y'all what these friggin' freaks. It's all they ever talk about, man. Name of his titles. Thank you all so much for all the support. So much stress has been lifted off this tiger. Somebody must have bought the tiger some hotel or something. Yeah. Bro. And that's no bullshit. I would love to I would love to have I would love to have this massive fucking army behind me, but I don't have it. I don't I don't I don't I don't really need it. I, mean, I, would, I would love to. I mean it, we would get so much more done so much quicker if I had if I had a hundred thousand followers, you know what I mean? And and, and 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 all these people just sitting there firing off on the same page. But but when you get when you get negative people in the world that just want to want to produce negativity. Drama. And drama and bullshit. It kind of it kind of clouds the water for real legitimate people like myself trying to make a change in this fucked up world. You know what I mean? Trying to make a change. And that's for real. Kipper, that's him. Get to know. Yeah. Real mama T T B T T B T. Yes, Aaron speaks. She says, "Well, I'll talk." Kipper, people are like, "Well, yeah. that was kind of rude. That was rude of you to say 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 it like that." Well. What do you want to know? Ask me questions. What do you want to fucking know about pedophilia in this country? What do you what do you want? I, I'm the walking, talking, motherfucking dictionary of pedophilia in this country. Well, I know my shit. That's well, a proud that's well claim, there, Tacho. Like we're we're at eighty one percent. That's a proud title to have, ain't it, Kemper? Dude, he's over throwing numbers around like Ernie too. Walking, talking dictionary, he said. What a moron. Well, say it. so let me guess he's doing what Ernie was doing and that's his grift like I don't think he can stay sober long enough to do it but whatever 
Let me get back here. My streams are never Listen, listen to this dude, man. Like he says something here in a minute that's just dumb. Of people in the United States have been violated sexually at one point in time in their life. Eighty fucking one percent of all Americans have been sexually violated at one point in time in their life. You want to know? Ask me questions. What do you want to fucking know about? Eighty-one percent of all Americans have been sexually violated. I don't believe that one. About pedophilia in this country. What do you? What do you want? I, I'm the walking, talking motherfucking dictionary of pedophilia in this country. Whatever. I know my shit. Like you guys would be amazed. Like we're we're at eighty-one percent of people in the United States have been violated sexually at one point in time in their life. Eighty fucking one percent of all Americans have been sexually violated at one point in time in their lives with with the majority of them being sexually violated multiple times upon multiple times. No way. And it's not, it's like people are like, well, who's, well, well, what's your idea? Listen, that, that leaves 19%, bro. 19% in, in the United States that have not been violated. He's talking out of his ass, bro. Yeah, he's making up numbers like Ernie, like you said. Yeah. Just making shit up. Yeah, the pedophile. Well, it's not that guy that don't have any teeth with long, creepy hair and glasses and drives a creeper van and scrawny little fucking creepy little weird old... You mean like you? Weird Al Yankovic looking fucking mother... No, it's motherfuckers wearing suits and ties and doctors and lawyers and dentists and... like. I mean, if 81% of Americans have been violated, it's fucking everybody, buddy. Everybody. Yeah. I was going to say, just about everybody that looks any certain way is going to be subject. Yeah. Your brother, your cousin, your uncle, your aunt, your niece, your nephew. Like, we all, whether we know it or not, whether we are actually aware of it or not. Listen, I, I'm, I'm just going to debunk his fucking number right here because... Now, I'm sure everybody hasn't told me. I'm sure some people don't speak about it a lot. But, you know, I'm going to say roughly 5%, maybe a little higher, of the people I know and have been, you know, have spoken to in my lifetime have have told me or that I know of that have been violated. Now, I know that's a low number. But, you know, and like I said, there's probably people who haven't told me or probably the stuff I don't know about. But 81%, bro? No way, man. That's Where'd you get that number? I'd love to know where you got that number. We know, everybody knows a pedophile. Whether they, If anybody is subscribed, ask him where you got that number. You know it or not, everybody knows a pedophile. Everybody, when you when you go into a grocery mall, grocery store, or, or, or a mall, and you go, now I believe that that's possible that everybody knows. Well, I wouldn't say everybody. Okay, okay. I would this, say most people know. Okay, check this out. I'm reading nationwide: eighty-one percent of women and forty-three percent of men reported experiencing some kind of sexual harassment and/or assault in their lifetime. <clears throat> that's eighty-one percent of women. 81% of women. And then 43% of men. Yeah. So I wonder what the total is. I would say it's probably in the fi- mid 50 to 60 percentile. Yeah. Total. Probably, probably about right. And that, that makes a lot more sense. Right. Going and doing your shopping. So, it would blow your fucking mind. Dictionary. Walking, talking dictionary. Yeah. He, what's he doing is Googling shit and cherry picking. It's that scam, that grift. Yep. On how many people you pass by every single day and you smile and wave to that will, that are on their way home or just came back from raping and molesting a child. Oh, my God. Or they're going to, they're they're getting... It See, happens. The kind of people he every, to there. It or not, everybody, whether we know it or not. Yeah, that's exactly. That's all they talk about, bro. It's all they yeah. think about. It's all that's in their frigging head. Yeah, because it pays whether we are actually aware of it or not, we know everybody knows a pedophile. Whether they know it or not, everybody knows a pedophile. Everybody, 
when you when you go into a grocery mall, grocery store, or or, or a mall, and you're going and doing your shopping, it but would blow your fucking mind I'll on how many this. people. Everybody might know a pedo, but that doesn't mean every person you know is a pedo. Right. Exactly. I mean, put it into fucking logic, bro, to reality. Yeah. Damn. People, you pass by every single day and you smile and wave to that that are on their way home or just came back Fear from tactics. raping. Yep. Fear tactics. Trying to make some money. Oh, he mm -hmm. needs the resources too, I bet, to do his research. They're molesting a child. Or they're going to, they're, they're getting... It happens. How would you say that? Every 30, let this sink in. Every, a child is sexually violated in our country every 30 fucking seconds. You gonna Google that one, Kipper? A child is sexually violated every 30 seconds in our country. I'll look it up in a minute. Every 30 seconds, people. I don't believe it. That's a lot. That's a fucking issue. It's almost like every 30 seconds. Right, yeah. We just need to stand together as one. Yeah. I'm uh, smooth. I, I, I would probably agree. I, I hate to say it, but everyone I'd say probably does know a PDF file. They might just not be caught yet, which is so fuck. I agree that you're probably right. Everybody probably does know one. That don't mean everybody knows that person is one, but yeah, right. I'd say everybody probably does know one, and that's that's sad. Well, the way he's trying to make it sound is like everyone you know is one, and that's not the way it works. He's trying to get people drummed up with those fear tactics. That's all that is. It's bullshit. Yep. Sorry, but we've seen it before with Ernie long before you there, Aaron. Beyond stupid knows of a P P do, but don't know one personally. Yep. Right. Yeah, he's inflating those statistics. He's boy, he sure is. Oh, gaslighting. Yep, gaslighting. My buddy had a coworker who seemed like a weirdo and sure as shit got busted for CP. Yeah. I mean a lot of them do, you know. And the ones who get busted, hallelujah, praise the Lord that somebody got them. Um like like that one guy who came on our channel the other night from NV Cap and and Alex. Those those guys are doing the Lord's work, man. They're doing great stuff. Yes, they have. All right, Kim Louise. Love you. Good night, Good night Kim Louise. Thanks for yeah. having me. Yeah, this is a touchy subject for some people. I'm gonna I'm gonna cut this shit off. That's um yeah, that's Exactly, Susie Q. What's he doing to stop it or to help stop it? We know it was about a year and a half ago. Uh, he was yeah. online begging. So uh, everything we've seen, he's had donations being given or some kind of bullshit going on. Yeah. We've seen it. It is yeah. what it is. Don't be fake, especially about this shit with saving kids, man. Nope. I don't take kindly to fakers at all. I mean, it's, you know, they, they, they jump in these damn um, kids' cases and act like there's something they're trying to, you know, like Ernie inserted himself in that one case. I'm not even going to say what it is because, you know, it's none of our business. Like, it's not what we came here for, but he absolutely did that, you know, and just for money, just for money because he saw a cash cow, what he tried to do. What you tried to do. Guess Skern's not doing his job too well. Statistics that high. Man, I hate to think. I would hate to think the world is that fucked up. Now, is there probably 81% of people that are bad people? I would say so. I would I would agree with that. Um, or have bad intentions on stuff. Yeah, oh, easy. Still got forty three, loser. Um, just saying. 
Ernie's got a message for me. Let me play it right quick. Let's see his message for me. And the little ones that can't. But I think it's something that God would appreciate too as well, especially him taking up for the kids and the little ones that can't defend themselves against these monsters and predators. I do appreciate you and uh, everyone, if you can, please subscribe to Aaron. Now, I'm not, I, I didn't want to make a big, big live out of this. To be honest with you, I've been traveling like crazy and I'm very tired. I want to get rested up. I want to get ready. I want to get my full strength back and ready to go. Read my message to Jim Toe. Okay, Rebels, is that on a community post or something? Or Look, here's the thing. I really don't even want to bring his name up because this guy's going nowhere. He ain't going I'm anywhere. going nowhere. I ain't worried about that. I don't want to go anywhere, Kemper. I'm happy right where I'm at. Yep. Thank you. I do need rest, guys. And it's in chat. Okay, cool. Your message to Jimbo. Let me look up here. Hey, Jim, tell your subs you have no content unless you're streaming us. Well, oh, he's streaming us, talking about us, or if you... <laughs> Snubs, I have no content. Listen, oh, dirty. he's never going nowhere. Here's my never message going to nowhere. Jimbo. Get a life, man. Get a life. Get a life and get off get mine, seriously, because you're never going to beat me. There's nothing you can beat do. Beat him at what? And you only cause me to get stronger. Yeah, you look strong. Powerful. You look strong and powerful. And that's huh? you. And others like you that calls that. <laughs> so I do appreciate everyone. Thank you all. Um, I can't express the gratitude. You can't express the gratitude, bro. Listen, Ernie does look awful strong. <laughs> awful strong. Like I, I must admit, you know that I, I have made him stronger. Of course, you know. Um, and and to those who don't like Ernie, I apologize for making him such a powerful being that he is. Um, and I do want y'all to know that I'm not going nowhere. He's right. He's right. Um, I'm not going to be a politician. I'm not going to get elected into office. Um, I'm not going to be a you know million dollar YouTuber like Easy. Um, I'm just Jimbo. You know, substitute school teacher. Maybe a full time school teacher next year. Um, I'm in in talks. Um, at a private school, but um, I don't want to go anywhere. I want to stay right here, be myself, and raise my children, and then enjoy my grandchildren before I leave this world. That's all I want to do. I don't need to beat you, Ernie. Beat you at what? Are we keeping score? You don't want to do that. Idiot. Idiot. Only, Trixie said, only thing strong about Skern is his rancid smell. Right. Dude ain't got no shoes. The thing is, though, man, Ernie could do better, and he chooses not to, and that's the problem. That's been the problem. Mm -hmm. He could do the right thing. He could do it the right way. He just don't want to. Yeah. And he knows that he's not. And he knows he's going to make money either way. Yeah. So he just goes the one that's what he thinks is the least effort. In the end, it's not. He just He's choosing the harder way. Yeah. And when you use a subject like saving kids as your lie, that definitely carries a certain amount of weight in karma. More than most. It's not a good thing. It's not a good, no. Yeah. And now, I mean, honestly, you, you've heard me say it since you met me, me being a uh, survivor myself. It pisses me off knowing he does what he does. 
you know, and he's doing it the way he is. People that actually do care. Yeah, I guarantee you there's a couple over there that care about kids over there, even supporting Ernie. But they're misled by Ernie. They think he's something that he's not. They think he does shit that he's never done. Yeah. It's sad. That's why we decided, hey, we got to tell the world. And of course, everybody, oh, Ernie's your only content. What for Ernie? You wouldn't have content. Motherfucker, if it wasn't for Ernie, we wouldn't have started a channel to out his ass. Yeah. That's the point. Y'all miss that entire fucking thing. We're here to basically sound off, to be the Paul Revere or whoever. Let people know. Get away from this dude. He's a train wreck. He is a train wreck. Lady Jane Rogue said, we don't have to run state to state over, over her turn. Right. <laughs> Kyle said, how's that working for you in 2024? I don't think 2023 was that great for you either, Ernie. Yeah, but he said 2024 was going to bring great things, and we've seen him in a tornado. Mm -hmm. We've seen him in the hood. We've seen him with one sock and no shoes. We've seen a lot of shit. Yeah. But greatness. Me too, Susie Q. I hope whoever has let him lay on our couch don't have children. I do too. Cat Swan said Jimbo has a great life and family. He does not. That's right. I don't like. He keeps saying you can't beat me. The fuck's he think we're doing? We are all living in life compared to Skern. Yep, we are. But the thing is, is like I was just saying, if Ernie did something the right way or for the right reasons, the shit might not blow up in his face like it does. But you should consider a certain amount of blowback for any kind of bullshit you pull. And it's never going to be the same amount you put in. It's coming back at least twofold. Yeah. That's never good. Yeah, Tracy, you're right. You know, you can't beat Skern at being a low life POS lying, grifting criminal. I can't. He's better admit that. On his live stream this morning while in the Uber, he told everyone Shelby was molested by three guys in prison and is getting charges for it. Can you imagine what the Uber driver was thinking? Wow. Yeah. Listen, this guy is literally living on somebody else's dime, uh, getting Ubers paid for and, um, I mean, if he was doing the good work, I could see it, but he's not. He's lying about doing the good work. Yeah. I mean, I could really see that, man, because that that is something that people support, and that is something to support. But Ernie's a lie. Yeah, he's never done anything. He's never. a fake. His credentials, no. His non-criminal record, none of that exists. Yeah. Every day is like, what's his story going to be? Sounds like he's not going to make it by the end of his life. He sounds normal. Yep. That's what he does. I'm just making him stronger over here, y'all. I mean, hell, I know this for the same reason I did, because me and Jimbo's talked about it. We, we thought Ernie was going to do good for himself. So we decided, hey, let's give Ernie a chance. And a lot of shit blew up in our faces for giving those chances. And Ernie literally turned around and pissed on both of us. In different ways, it wasn't like just one thing and boom, it covered both of us. No, 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 no. He did multiple fucking things. No, he did. So, I mean, for people, oh, you don't give him a chance. Uh, no, we did. And he made fools of us. Not again. That will never happen again. That's right, Miss Horse Whispers. You'll, you'll, you'll know them by their fruits. Compare the fruit Jimbo has compared to the fruit Urn shows. That's yep. exactly right. What you put in, you get out. Kemper, that video is done. Yep. We got something to show? Not yet. Oh, okay. Let's see. Lady Jane Rowe, member for 12 months. Happy birthday, Kemper. Hey, Earth. How are you? Narcissistic Times said Ernie sees everything as a game of survival slash win. Being smartest, the best, they'll fight over what's considered fruit and vegetable because it's about fragile ego needs to be right to feel valued. Yeah, he does. And he, he thinks lying makes him right. Um, when he says I'm going nowhere, I guess he's right. You know, I mean, I don't plan to go nowhere. You know, I'm happy with my life. 
Um, I don't need YouTube. I don't need Facebook. I've got a wife I've had for 31 years. You know, I just hope, you know, that um, I can make her happy for the rest of my life. And my children. So I'm be the best dad I can be every day. That's it. Um, whatever it takes. And that's not being sappy. That's just the truth. I, I don't have any crazy goals. Ask Ernie what his goal is. What's your goal, Ernie? What do you want to be? What do you want to be when you grow up? That's easy. Hey, easy. What do you want to be when you grow up? Fact is, they're both grown up. I was going to say, by the size of them right now, I don't think they'll ever attain that goal. Yeah. I was going to, yeah. What are you going to be when you grow up, easy? I won't be six foot. I want to be a gangster. Yeah. Yeah. We ain't worried about Ern. Um, we're going to keep bringing the thunder on him. It's like we did the criminal record today. Um, mm -hmm. We may get the report from New York. Uh, yeah. I'm sure there's a few things in New York that we don't know about. Yeah. And we get specifics on the other things. Well, let's, uh, let me see if I can find that report that was found. Let's see. Because we do know, you know, the most recent thing in, was it January of 2023? Around the time that his arraignment was happening, didn't he catch that criminal trespass yep. in New York? And then, of course, um, the one where he was walking around pretending to be law enforcement, carrying a baton and a hypodermic instrument, which he claims was for his mask making. But Oh, you, you mean this one I'm going to share right here? This one? Yep. Uh, let's see here. Let me read this out loud. Location, Hamilton Street. This is in New York. June 26, 2019, 11.38 p.m., right before midnight. Suspicious person arrest. Narrative. Patrols responded to the area of Hamilton Street and Van Wyck Street, or Van Wyck, how do you pronounce it, for a report of a male walking back and forth on his cell phone. Well, that sounds right. Patrol units located 39-year-old Ernest Shell of Corbin, Kentucky. After investigating, Mr. Shell was arrested for criminal possession of a weapon in the fourth degree and possession of a hypodermic instrument. Concealed. Mr. Shell was released on his own recognizance. Uh, I have no criminal record, Kipper. Right. Yeah, no criminal record. Um, yeah, I'm going to make a little video of his Kentucky report, and I'm going to put that on, uh, on our channel. If I can, I'll screenshot and put as much of it on the community posts as I can. There's six pages. I think it limits you to five. I mean, <laughs> honestly, I think there's a, like, you got the state of New York, the state of Tennessee, the state of Virginia, the state of Kentucky. Bro, I'd be willing to bet he's got shit that's happened in Georgia and North Carolina, too. Hell yeah. well, we, know, we know he's got the arrest at citation in Georgia. Oh, yeah, that is right. Yep. We know that for a fact. Yep. I got that's a true. damn picture of it. Yep. And then um, I forgot how much time he spent in South Carolina. I'd be yep. willing to bet he's got fucking some kind of criminal record. Whether it be convictions, charges, arrest, whatever, that is called a criminal record, Ernie. You want to play the word game? But I guarantee you, he's at what nine states? Yep. That's not counting places like Arkansas and Texas that he claims to spend a lot of time in. Yep. Narcissistic Times said if Ernie was living his best life, he and uh, if he was winning and as he considers it, he wouldn't be having problems holding on to footwear. He wouldn't be bothered by what you or others say about him. You're absolutely right, narcissistic. Leslie B. said that idiot wasn't even making masks four or five years ago, was he? That was about the time he was yep. claiming to be. He, I don't think he ever made that one. Was the end. Yeah, that was, that was near the end. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I think his... Because uh, as in 2017 would be... 17 when he had the, the uh, horror at the Plex. I think but, so. Yeah, I think um, 
after the horror duplex, he claimed to make some masks, but I don't think he actually made them. I think he just took some money from people. Yeah, and I know he took credit for making masks that he never made, like Tony did those nine or whatever, eight or nine that he did. Um, you know, of course, he stole the one that Tony made for Cody and then resold it to someone else. They ended up making a video about it. You know, there, there's all that ignorance that he pulled. Of course, you know, he's got staged pictures with um, his kid and I think his stepdaughter, maybe. Yeah. But they were photo, you know, staging photos like they were painting masks. But, you know, good and well, anybody that's selling those masks for what they are, they're not going to have kids working on them. Right. So, <laughs> especially that age. Yeah. We're not stupid, Ernie. Nano CA2 informed me without the face sheet, it's five pages. So we'll get that on our community post. Yep. Kemper may put it on his too. It don't hurt to put it everywhere. I was going to say, I, I'm, I'm going to see if there's a link. And if there is, I'm just going to post it to the community wall for it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I had another one over here. Was, oh, there we are. October 50, member for 21 months. Hashtag stand family proud. Love you, October. Everything he says is a lie, a con move, or an excuse. Absolutely correct, Kyle. No patience for stupid. Whatever happened to the t shirt machine that was bought for him? Sold it for his next fix, like the money for the t shirts. Uh, we said that a couple days ago. Like, wasn't it supposed to be worth five thousand? What he said, like, you, you at least getting 50 bucks for it, at least. And he's the one without a hotel room, without food, without clothes, without shoes, like all that, shit. right? So, you would think anybody that's got a anything that's worth five thousand dollars and they're homeless are getting rid of it if they can. So I don't know what the fuck he's begging about unless he just didn't have a t-shirt machine. Because even, even if a person isn't into t-shirt machines, if they see a profit, most people will do it. Because on the internet and online buying and everything that goes on these days, it's not hard to get rid of that shit. Yeah. Leslie said it was seven years ago. I, I know he didn't make them for a large amount of time. So I'm going to say, no, he wasn't making them four years ago. I'd say... Uh, he probably wouldn't make them. It's around 2019, 2020. He, it was, what was it, June? It, of it was right. It was basically, it was right before the whole trial and everything happened, is yeah. when the masks were being made. Whenever the trial, was it after happened, the trial, when it was completely stopped, I believe, after that. I think it was after the trial because it was June, right? Let me look. Let me look. Here, it's, it's on the screen there. Let me, let me go look at it. June 26th. Oh, yeah, that was in 2019. 2019. Yeah. I thought, I thought you were talking about the other, but yeah. It was three months after the trial, yeah. But 2019 was that very eventful year for him. You know, the trial, um, everything that happened with him and Jackie. You know, you had uh, the shit with him and Phil, him running down the highway. Uh, we know of at least three highway run type incidents. I think Jacksboro was also in 2019 or 18, the end I of 18. Think so, man. So, like, there was a lot of shit that went down in that time period. But mm -hmm. then, if you remember, right after that is when he became the great child savior and the bounty hunter. Like, that's when he really started pushing it. That's when he connected with Tina was in, like, the end of uh, 2020, the beginning of 21. So, like, he was building up with all this QAnon bullshit in the entire year of 2020. But that's when QAnon had their heyday. That was when they were really pushing their fucking bullshit. You know yeah. what I mean? And Not so everything about him and Tina was QAnon as well. That includes saving children. There's a video right there. Not bought. I shared the link. That video, if you can't get it figured out, will walk you straight through on an iPhone how to do it. Um, a lot of the iPhones, you can't, they're, they're, you can't find the join button for some reason. Yeah, you got to go. Absolutely, use this little video right here. Browser. Just click on that link, and it'll, there's a video, and it shows you how to do it. it takes a couple minutes. It's real easy. Um, I had something else shared up here. What was that? Just missed it. Oh, they said it's Penny Positive said that they, he claims his uh, the machine is at his sister's house. I I really doubt that. Yeah, there is no machine. No, at anybody's <laughs> house. Miss Horse Wizards, but we've been saying that for a long time. But he probably, about that. 
he probably knows somebody that's got a five thousand dollar machine, or knows of someone that's got a five thousand dollar machine. Well, listen, um, I know somebody's got a direct to garment machine, mm -hmm. and and she's a friend of mine, a good friend of mine, um, and she was willing willing to sell that machine to me on payments. It's a um, it, she wanted five thousand dollars for it. I'm mm -hmm. sure that's where he got his number at, but she ain't selling him shit. Um, he was he was uh, made a sexual advance towards her, and she's married. Um, so she told him to fuck off first night she ever saw him. Yeah, Ernie does keep recycling the same BS, Miss Horse Whispers. Every so often he comes up with a new uh, quotation marks plan scam, but it always turns out to be something he's tried before and never delivers. That's right, never delivers. Yeah. Daisy Joe, he's such a good con. All those, all those that spent money on those shirts and hoodies are just accepting the fact they've been scammed. Very weak individuals. Yeah, they are weak. Right behind right now. They don't have no machine. No, he don't have no machine. That's a double negative, by the way. He doesn't have a machine. Sorry. There you go. One more time, Kemper. Happy birthday! And his and his. Um, Cash app is dollar sign, Lycan Daddy, L-Y-C-A-N, Daddy. Easy knows how to spell that, even though he's not one. Lycan Daddy, 73. I was going to say, don't mistake it for my screen name tonight. Yeah. That's Easy's Daddy there. Yeah. Kipper was born in 73. But together, um, I'm Easy and Ernie's Daddy, huh? That's right. Double up. Double up. Yeah, I was born in 73. That was a hell of a year, though, man. Yeah. Hell of a year. Narcissistic times. The stand knows, or uh, Ernie knows you're not trying to compete with him. He has to use you to keep pushing that content narrative to his subs for attention and grifting. It's recycled garbage. Yeah. You're absolutely right. To push that sympathy yeah. button. Oh, they're so mean to him. I'm going to send him $20 so they can get him a taco. Yeah. Like, that's literally what why he does it. Stupidity. Yeah. Thank you, Golden One, for becoming a new YouTube member. Welcome to the stand. Thank you very much. Appreciate you. Um, That's funny behind green eyes. Yeah, he was trying to say um, it was so shady, and he, he was afraid he was going to get shot. But then again, he gets an Uber in a good area of town, and he's telling the dude in the car, don't shoot him. Yeah. So mm -hmm. like, that's, that's his ball game. Right. How do you almost get shot? I mm -hmm. mean, just put this? Is that what happened? Or <laughs> I, I mean, come on, man. Come on. Come yeah. on. All right. Kimber? Yes, sir. Two hours over, buddy. We are good to go. And um happy birthday, my brother. I'm Thank glad you have a birthday. Thank you for all the uh, birthday wishes and cash apps everybody sent. I do appreciate it, guys. It means a lot. Yeah, I did that double negative, put it in earning language. I know. Thank you. Thank you, Ryan Green. I'm having my back. That's when you make our mods, you got your back. <laughs> anyway, um, we have to take Sarah back to college tonight. She's still here. Um, uh -oh, so road trip. I must bid you adieu. Um, there comes you some happy birthday wishes, brother. Uh, let me give you some Kemper Sinatra before we go, since it is his birthday. Not be on the first one. I think it's on the first page. You do not have a place, bitch boy. You don't have a fucking place. Fuck off. There you go. All right. Tomorrow night. Tomorrow Wednesday. Tomorrow is late night. You want to take tomorrow off? We can. Um, if we if we decide to go live, we'll let you know. But um, we've been talking about maybe taking Wednesdays off, so um, we might try that tomorrow night too. But either way, we'll either see you tomorrow or Thursday. If we come Thursday, it'd be a little bit early, probably. Yeah, I know we discussed doing Tuesdays and Thursdays a little bit earlier, and taking Wednesdays off to try yeah. to balance out what times that we're live and 
everybody can get a chance to be in lives, you know. Absolutely. Yeah. So uh, until next time, I'm Jimbo. And I'm Kipper. Coming to you live from the stand. Sometimes I get so mad, there's no control in me My thoughts get so bad, I'm like I might grab a bat, I don't know My wrath, my blood boils over like Oh God, here goes I lost all feeling from my head to my toes You said some shit that I can't let go So just stay tuned for the rest of the show So have you ever felt betrayed? Switch is how you see things Realize something needs change Cause I know you got me up. Let me show you what's up Enough is enough I'll take a face full of payment Just to make a statement I know there's no turning back Oh God, adrenaline wasted So mad I can taste it I know there's no turning back I'll do what it takes I ain't making mistakes like that I'll play it on your face To make you go take it back I'll lose my shit I go crazy when I'm mad Thanks for trying me. Right. Now it's finally time to see how this rivalry becomes a dynasty.